exciting and new. Come aboard. We're expecting you. I'm Sister Patricia. Captain, I want to thank you and the steamship line for your generosity for my transportation. I don't know how else I would have gotten there. Could you please tell me how to send this wire to Alcapulco? I want to confirm I'm on my way. Well, Steve, I'm fine. And so are you. You're very famous for an ex-skinny dipper. It was a very painful time, Steve. I really needed you. You know, Mother died. And my brother, Bill, was missing in action. I was really quite alone. I, I, I didn't, I just didn't want to go on. Well, I moved many times. New faces and new places, but nothing seemed to help. And then I decided that I had to find an inner peace, something within myself. I'm Sister Patricia. Well, you don't look like a nun. Steve, I like what I do. In 48 hours, I'll be in Acapulco with my children in the convent school. And we'll both be back on track. Right now, I think we're living a little in the past. Well, old honesty makes me admit that I've always been attracted to you. But, Steve, the church is my life. And I can't change. Oh, come on, just one more game, I'll let you win. You know something, Steve. You haven't let up on the work. You've been to the ship to shore telephone at least a dozen times. Well, we're all mighty special. Sometimes we forget it. That's Hobson's choice. Sometimes it's very painful. And then again, it's filled with joy. I care for him, too. We've shared a lot together. And now I meet him again. And in these few days, I've relived my entire life. The trip was fine. As a matter of fact, it was delightful. You know, th this is the first time I've seen you. Look like a nun. <laughs> I'm still the same old Patty Feeney. We're so much alike, Steve. We have a purpose in life. And that purpose is our life. You know, if I had a question, it was answered the moment I stepped foot in this convent and I saw the faces of those little children in the school. They're my purpose. And I'll be very happy and very fulfilled. When I was a little girl and I wanted to keep from crying, I used to go into our backyard and I'd look up at the sky and I'd talk to God and I'd talk to myself until the pain in my heart went away. Goodbye, Steve. Will we meet again? Another time, another place. Bye, Acondia, Steve.